Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Mornings with Kay, where I literally just talk about nothing. Everybody makes fun of me because my my mugs always cover my face. Like when I drink them. Hold on, I'll show you. Mm hmm. Totally covering my face. I was trying to think of like topics because I'm 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 always afraid that I'm gonna run out of things to say during these. So I want to make up topics so that I can at least this is this was um this was what's the word suggested to me by one of my friends. She said that I should kind of make topics and maybe an outline that I could follow just because and part of me wants to do this because I know that I'm so awkward and I'm so um I get off track a lot. I have ADD or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> but part of me thinks like, oh well, this is like a morning show where I literally just babble. Like this isn't like a um a scripted video that about topics, you know what I mean? And I do want to do those things. I do want to do like things that annoy me and things that I hate and things that I'm good at and things etc you know but <clears throat> I think because I understand what she's saying and I agree with her and I totally get it because I know I'm so awkward <laughs> and uh, it's it's sort of part of me but at the same time I know I can get over it but at the same time, I don't know if I want to get over it because it is part of me and I am very awkward and it's just how I am. And I don't know. I've said this before, like, should I make topics on things to talk about or should I just like babble? And I'm conflicted because I'm afraid that if I put topics on this video or this series or whatever you want to call it that it will get too serious like it'll be to me it will turn into more of a segment than just me sitting down and talking with you and I don't want her to think that I'm not taking what she said to heart because I am I'm just thinking about it <laughs> I don't really want this to turn into a segment and for me that's what it would turn into if I had to make topics it would turn into like bite-sized news it would turn into gaming news it would turn into something that I don't want it to be and I'm afraid that it would do that and I don't I don't want it to because I I love this time this is one of my favorite things to do honestly and I mean, I think you guys are enjoying it. I, you said you enjoyed it, right? You're not lying, right? <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I'm conflicted. And I'm trying, I'm trying so hard, guys, to come out of my shell. And I feel like I'm doing better. And I feel like I'm opening up more or just embracing myself more because since I started doing this, let me let me rewind even more. Okay, since I've done YouTube, oh my. <laughs> when I first started YouTube, I was so shy. So shy. And please don't go watch my old videos. I mean, you can. I left them up because I was afraid, you know, I don't want to take down my past where I started from. So I left them up and every day I sort of regret it. <laughs> but I leave them up because that's where I came from and I don't want to forget that and I don't want to forget how I started this. So I leave them up and if you go watch them you'll see how awkward I was. And I was so much more awkward than this, believe me, so awkward. <laughs> and I feel like I've come out of my shell so much because my reason for starting YouTube was mainly to just open up and to to find myself or to um what's the word to just discover myself in a way where I'm not afraid to be that person anymore and I'm still 20 in my 20s you know I'm 22 and I'm not like at all old 
yet. I mean, I still have a ways to go and people probably still say like, oh, you probably haven't found yourself yet. You know, you're still kind of trying to figure it out. And I am, I'm still trying to figure it out. You know, I'm, I'm an adult, I'm a new adult, okay? I have a lot of problems right now and it's stressing me out and I'm learning how to do, how to have I'm learning how to adult okay <laughs> see I went off on a tangent again she was right <laughs> I, I just started this YouTube journey to be more open with myself and to let myself kind of blossom I guess I hate that word and I think that I've done it well and I've had such a good group of people to do that with because you guys are just you're so supportive and you're so helpful and you're so just okay with this awkwardness <laughs> and i feel like i could script it but for me it would turn into something that's not so enjoyable because i'm bad with i'm bad with speaking in general like in general, I'm bad with it. I'm bad with talking to people. Like, if I hate going to family reunions because I ask the same question all the time and I answer the same answer and they're always disappointed in me <laughs> because I've never went to college. Okay, he's never went to college. She must be a terrible person. I think I want to leave it unscripted just because I don't want it to turn into something that I hate. And I'll leave the scripting for like actual topics like those will be separate videos like i won't turn that into mornings with k because mornings with k is literally like you sitting down or having a cup of coffee or tea or whatever we have that day and we're just we're just talking and i wish you guys could talk back <laughs> and you sort of do in the comments and i respond but that's what this time is and i'm really enjoying it and i think it's so fun and i feel like it's really helping me just as a person in general because I don't have a lot to talk to, or I don't have a lot to talk about, but I find something. And to me, that helps because on the moments of the, in a conversation when it just gets like awkward, awkward silence, <laughs> you know, I'm just, I just like, I don't know what to do. What do I say? Um, uh, how's your cat? It's helping me come up with things to say quicker than I usually would, if that makes sense. I'm trying, trying, trying so hard to like, just stop being like this all the time because people think that I'm depressed and they think that I smoke weed so I've been trying to like up my beat a little bit and it helps my day in general like I, I am a very calm person but I feel like when I when I talk to a camera that sounds so mundane and boring and people are like wow she has not come out of her shell yet not watching her. People have told me that I need to up my beat a little bit and I, I understand and I do need to up my beat. I'm working on it. I'm sorry. But I don't think that I'm going to script this. I think I just want to keep it the way it is for now because it's helping me slowly come out of that awkwardness that she was talking about. And it's something that I need to work through. It's not something I can just get over and it's so hard. It's like one of the hardest things I've ever done just get out of myself but I think I'm gonna go thank you for listening to me again <laughs> um, I'll see you guys tomorrow bye